Hi, welcome to my channel. In today's session, we will learn about database backups and how to restore a database backup from backup file. This is very important topic in SQL Server. So, whatever the database we have, we have to maintain a database backup. Suppose if something is deleted or something, if you want to retrieve the data from old backups so then you need backup file so in today's session we will learn how to take a backup from sql server this is my sql server management studio so i am connecting with windows authentication click on connect i have different databases i want to restore any one database here also we have two types of where we can design mode also we can take the backup and we can restore and second one is through query also we can take the backups database backups and we can restore first we'll see in design mode how to take a database backup suppose if you want to take a database backup first right click on the database suppose i'm going to take demo db database backup right click on the database click on tasks click on backup so here source it will ask which database you want to take the backup I want to take demo db copy only backup so this will take only copy of a backup so it will not take log files and all okay and backup type is full or differential suppose already you are taken daily you are taking database backup so whatever the changes happen after previous backup that only it will take suppose i want most of the times we will take full database backup so i am selecting as full and it will ask backup set name so this will be the name where it will create for your backup set and you can schedule a backup also if you set me suppose i am setting it will expire after some time so if you want to you don't want to set any expiry otherwise it will not happen back so here i want to save it to disk where you want to save by default sql server will select this path c program files and where your sql server management studio here install so it will be taken and it will be saved into the database backups so i don't want to store here click on remove add manually I am changing the path storage path by default it will be saved in backups I am storing in db restore I am store not db restore I am storing in db backups so here you have to give the file name I want to give it as demo db dot VAK. so this file database backup file will be saved as demo db so click on ok ok and your path will be storage path will be c drive db backups your file name will be demo db click on ok it's executing it's 100 percent the backup of database demo db completed successfully click on ok now we'll go and see see demo db backup is completed this is what they, they create so like this we can take the database backup also we can take backup through query take a database backup this is the syntax backup is the keyword database is the keyword here to provide the database name which you want to take the backup to disk and storing on disk you have to provide the path where you want to save and that database name you have to provide here so this is the example syntax backup database demo db this is the database name to disk where you are going to save is c drive db backups demo db dot back so bak is file extension so always backup file will be created as dot bak that's why I provided as dot bak okay you'll see in sql server management studio how to create it how to take the backup from now I want to take backup from query. So click on new query, backup database, 
which database you want to take the backup I want to take demo DB what to do is to disk so I want to save to disk where to save C colon always you have to provide in single quote and slash db backups slash demo db dot dat this is the so this is the query backup database database name to disk so this is the path where you want to take the backup and store so always this path will be single quote within the single quote okay i want to save it on c drive db backup that backup name will be demo db dot pak now execute the query so query executed successfully now you go to that path c drive db backups and you check it so this database has been back okay so like this you can do backups so one is design mode also you can take the backups and through query also you can take the backups now we can restore the database to sql server so we are taking backup once so we will try to restore this db click on databases right click restore databases source will be from device because i have a database backup click on add db backups demo db click on ok so where you want to save my destination database will be demo i want to save it on C drive DB backups demo databases file name will be demo and my log also I'm storing on demo databases demo score log click on OK click on OK it's executing database demo restore successfully like this we can restore the database in today's session we had seen how to take a database backup in design mode and through query also we had seen how to restore a database through design mode that's it for today thanks for watching my video in next session we will meet with new topic thank you